Was Link's hair that long? A second ago? Am I crazy? Ah, Link. Finally, you wake. Whose voice was that? I've heard a great deal about you from Zelda. Your wounds were severe. I am relieved to see you escape death. Your arm, however, was beyond saving. I had to replace it, lest the injury endanger you further. How you lost your clothes, well... I too need to post pictures to Hylian Instagram. And I am terribly out of shape. I'm sorry. Uh, yeah, I'll just grab it. I was gonna wander around, but honestly, I'm just gonna grab it. Hmm. I think it'll buff out. Actually. I, I think it, it just needs a little bit of love. A little bit of spit. It'll buff right out. Decayed Master Sword, the sword that seals the darkness. Its sacred power has been diminished after being ravaged by the gloom beneath Hyrule Castle. I almost read that like a pro, and then I had to trip over my own tongue and fall. Well, I didn't fall, but I... You know. I, it's not why. <laughs> it's not why. It's B. <laughs> Let's see. In Breath of the Wild, the optimal the optimal way. I thought I just heard a laugh. In Breath of the Wild, the optimal way to deal damage was swing, 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 <laughs> and that's still the case. Spin attack, because then you double hit. What? I lost all my stamina. I lost my hearts, which was kind of cool. Not gonna lie, I kind of like I kind of like that cutscene. That was kind of a cool cutscene. And now I oh I also lost my clothes. I that's the one I really want an explanation for. There's a hmm. There isn't really a good way to explain that one away. I think this this mystery guy. Hmm. Not a fan of him yet, just based off of that alone. All right, let's cut these vines. That's gonna lock behind me, isn't it? <sighs> what? Wow. All right. Touchy? Touchy. Is this... Is this a dungeon? Please tell me this is a dungeon. Oh, it's a dungeon. Yes! It's a dungeon! It's a dungeon! It's a dungeon! Real quick, gotta, gotta see. I cannot dive, okay. Monolith Soft. Has a fear of water. What is that? Is that agoraphobia? No, it's aquaphobia. Agoraphobia is the fear of women. <laughs> oh, all right. <laughs> aquaphobia. That's the one. Yep, that's the one. Are there? There's no chest. I just walk forward. Okay. Already, this game's kind of. It's kind of what I predicted. Jump. Dive? Oh, I was really hoping. Uh, <clears throat> I kind of expected that we would we would be going through an underground segment um, as like the tutorial, but I kind of expected that would take place. This looks familiar. I thought that that would was going to take place before Zelda fell to her death and Link fell to his nudity. 
but I, I guess I guess it works. I'm waiting for the time shift zones because I don't know why I need to jump. Can't I just like walk? Oh, I know why. I know why. It's introducing that because of some of the stuff in the trailers where we jump and uh, right there, right there, jump. Huck. Landing in water, even from a great height, will prevent you from taking uh, taking fall damage. I almost read that as all damage. That's uh, a chest. It feels like archaic legwear. Simple, classic legwear. They're well-worn and showing their age, but they still got a few good years left in them. It can be a, a bit cumbersome to have to tie in the straps. Yep, okay. Open inventory, and now we get to that part of the game. Interesting. A lot. Hmm. A lot more of the screen's uh, uh, real estate is taken up by by Link here. And I think I think that's probably... Oh, wait. What did I make B? That's B. Oh, look at him. He has a kilt. He looks... He's so Irish. Is that Irish? Kilts? Kilts are still Irish, right? No one else has claimed those. No? We're good? Okay. Looks like there should have been something there. There's a lot of fog everywhere. Oh, we're high up, aren't we? We're in the sky. Yeah, we're definitely in the sky. I think I know what that is. Okay, hold the phone. <laughs> my first impression when I leave and find myself on a sky is to, like, walk out and be like, Oh, my word. And then we maybe get the title drop. But Link's like, mm, No, um, I think... I think someone has pictures of me in the nude and... Um, my girlfriend is gone again, and I lost my best arm, and I'm a hippie. So, time to die. Is this where I'm introducing the Let's Play? I think it is. We had a pretty cold start, or hot start? We had a pretty hot start. But I think it's now that I, I talk about how this Let's Play is going to work. Look at that, there's a dragon over there. I'm not gonna lie. The past three years have been an ordeal for us all. We lived through a pandemic and countless different strifes. The world isn't what it used to be for any of us. But... I'm returning to Let's Playing in an effort to reclaim some of my lost happiness. I know of these tragedies as well as anyone. And I had some of the worst... Actually, last year was, without a doubt, the worst year of my life. For reasons I'll go into later. And I'm trying to retrace my steps a little bit with this Let's Play. And perhaps... Perhaps... Become the person I used to be. And reclaim a little bit of what I lost. As for the game... Oh. It sank. As for this game... When I ended Breath of the Wild, I had some thoughts, and those thoughts were overwhelmingly positive. I believe my exact words were, I think this game ties Xenoblade as my favorite game of all time. And in the intervening years, yeah, years since that Let's Play, my opinions about Breath of the Wild couldn't be any further from that. It's still in my top 10, but honestly, I don't think it deserves to be so. And the only reason it, it is there is because of the experience I shared with you, not because of the game on its own merits. And so this game is going to be a little bit of a, I guess, thesis statement for saying that Breath of the Wild is my least favorite or perhaps the worst 3D Zelda ever made. 
I know that's a strong opinion, and I'm not going to back it up in words yet. I'm going to wait until we see some examples of ways they've improved upon Breath of the Wild's biggest flaws, and then I'm going to talk about those flaws, to talk about the sticking points that over and over, I've, I've talked to other people who've played the game and asked them what they thought, and formulated an opinion that is, unfortunately, overwhelmingly negative about Breath of the Wild. But every journey starts with a single step, and in this case, a giant fall into fog. I can't tell what dragon that is from here. I think we're about to fight an enemy considering some of the trailers. Tree branch. It's more powerful than the master sword. It is the master tree branch. Wooden branches such as this are pretty common, but it's surprisingly well balanced. It doesn't do much damage, but can serve as a weapon in a pinch. It also matches the color it also matches the color of the scenery. Oh, real quick. Oh, that's such a good improvement. Yes. Yes. The ability to drop items from this menu. And sort? Oh, wait, that's the wrong button. Ah. Huh. I like it. Sky shrooms. A common mushroom that grows near trees on sky islands. Eat it to restore health. This is the... I don't even remember what they're called in Breath of the Wild. It's the normal mushroom. All right, let's let's kind of run through this. We have all played Breath of the Wild at this point, and I'm not going to tr I'm tr going to try not to linger. I'm going to try not to linger on some of the introductory things like what is an apple. Instead, I'm going to jump right into it. B is sword. Ow. I I mixed up my controls, so I I need to relearn that. <laughs> Flurry rushing is still in the game. Jump out of the way in, uh, of an attack. Wait. Oh, wrong button. <laughs> Ow. I can't believe I still have Breath of the Wild muscle memory. I cannot believe it. Okay. B is Y. B is Y! My tree branch broke. Well, let's kill him. All right. What is this? Zone I charge, a material used as a power source for constructs and other devices. Its strange light seems to reveal potent energy inside. And a soldier construct horn. It's sharp, which will probably be used for the fuse mechanic, which I've learned about. All right, let's um, let's just do a quick little scope here. All right, no, no, uh, nothing, nothing. I'm gonna I'm gonna talk about there. I assume we're being shepherded this way to that wooden stick. Nice. Is that a chest? Uh, it looks interactable. And so does this. This is dumb. This is stupid. But I played Breath of the Wild, so I know that I can climb glass. And this is substantially more cor chorus porous than glass. <laughs> Come on. Come on, Link. I, be I believe in you! Jump! I did it! I will get the glorious reward. Which, there's no reward. Let's move on. Uh, let's equip... Let's go through my tree branches first. I doubt I'll need those soon. I'll get better stuff. Look at this. Link, the hero. Wielding the master tree branch. And using B because Oh, I went I went this way. My bad! <laughs> but it's fine, it was intentional in fact, because it led me to another tree branch. That is the wrong button. B is Y. Where am I going? Why uh, I should probably follow, you know, the blatant path. That seems like a good idea. Also, is this area autumn because you fall from here? Is that the reason why they went with that? Is that an enemy? Is it a drinking fountain? I need a broom. I hunger for brooms. Uh, uh, uh. Hi? Yes. 
Link, I have waited for you. Princess Zelda has- <laughs> I don't know why I'm channeling Kung Pao. Princess Zelda has left something for you in my care. Yeah. This is the... How did she pronounce it earlier? I always said para. Para? Uh, uh, para. It's the, the, the para pad. I am told it is an invaluable tool that will provide you with direction. It is a Sheikah Slate, but not. Princess Zelda's prize device. It has a variety of features that are essential for adventure. Like bombs. Maybe not bombs. I received it from Princess Zelda. I have now passed it on to you. My records indicate that Princess Zelda is waiting at the location marked on its map. My message has been delivered. We stand in the Garden of Time. Oh, not this again. The Temple of Time is visible from here. It was used in the distant past. Many rites and ceremonies of the kingdom were held there. But no more. Now it is a lonely place. No one visits. This is the... Okay, I... Uh, fine. Yes, this is the Garden of Time. This is all dialogue that I've said before. Can I leave this dialogue? There is no way to. I am sorry. I cannot help but reminisce. Hel head to the indicated location. Take care as you do. There are robots wielding sticks. I have touched the, the, the interface of time. And now I shall cross the bridge of time. That was helpful. Y is run, Y is B. Remember, always remember. I assume that, that's not an enemy. Enemy? No? Gonna take your apple, son. Don't mind me. Your sky apples. Is this a pot? Is this a sky pot? Now it's a sky shard. Hmm. One sec. One sec. Hmm. Sky apples? That's the wrong button. Hmm. Wooden stick. Hello. You seem to be new here. Do you intend to use that as a weapon against the soldier constructs? Yes! Soldier constructs are those of us given strict orders to protect this land. The Zonai who created us directed them to eliminate trespassers. They will consider you a trespasser. You must treat them as a serious threat. They have been known to wield sticks with deadly force. Allow me to offer unsolicited advice. It is crucial to maintain a proper distance and target your opponents. Okay, I don't need to know that. I, mm, I know. I've played a video game before. You may practice targeting on me if you want, but please do not actually attack! These things are kind of cute. Okay, I, I don't need... Thank you. No, that's the wrong button. Yes, thank you. They're kind of cute. They're new. And I have slightly mixed feelings on them, considering it, this is this is new territory that we're entering. It, it's all, it almost feels like they're... It almost feels like they're throwing out all of the lore of Zelda. And I have... We're, jury's out on that. Jury's out on that from my perspective. I'd rather they use the lore that they have. If I press jump here, won't I just die? No, we're good. Ooh, we're fine. I like what they're doing here, where they're kind of introducing... They're kind of... 
this is a, a cool tutorial area because it's it looks like it's super open-ended, but because we don't have the glider yet, it's surprisingly close-ended, right? Uh, let's... I haven't pulled up my map yet, so I have a temperature gauge, I have the noise gauge at the bottom, which I always thought was kind of useless. Uh, there's a cutscene for opening this, the map. Great Sky Island. Oh. Wait. Is this... Is this what I think it is? No way. No way, no way, no way, no way, no way. There's only one way to find out. No way. I think it is. Oh my word, it is. Hold up. I'm not gonna- I'm not gonna say what I'm thinking yet. Because I- I gotta confirm it for myself. That is the wrong button. B is Y. Is this what I think it is? Sky Shroom. Zone I charge. Okay, I, I don't really care about that. I don't really care about that. This is my title drop. This is my title drop. How do I get there? I can't. Man! Either I'm crazy. Maybe I'm crazy. I'll, I will accept that I'm crazy. I don't even want to say it. Is this Skyloft? Skyloft? 